fellow YouTubers. I'm Greg here. So I've been working on a top flight Corsair, I believe 60 size. Like a little older. I'm not sure. Most of you guys will know what this is. Anyways, picked it up out of Barry. Paid a few hundred bucks for the airframe, which is okay. I was going to do a new conversion anyway. So I just wanted to show you how I did it. So typical Turnigy G60, doing the 400 kV, because I'm probably going to be using a three-bladed prop, either 15 by 8 or 16 by 8. Um, what I do is I use these nylon spacers right here. And then what I do is I use these washers that have rubber behind them as a rubber backed washer. Now what they do is they prevent vibration. Now this was pretty easy because I guess top flight actually has the indicators for center of fuse. So basically I lined up my motor mount, did my drilling and it lined up perfectly. Um, nylon washers, some 832nd bolts running through some blind nuts. Now the challenge with this model is it's not really made for um, electric. All right, so unfortunately I'm gonna have to pull the wing off and insert the battery. I used the Home Depot stir stick. It's very light wooden, fairly strong actually. So it's basically glued in there and I've got a little piece of wood inside that's kind of holding it in place. I'm gonna be running two uh, three cell 5000s and I'll basically just strap it along here. Um, that's about it. I'm gonna use a receiver pack and everything else kind of came with this airplane. Anyways, hope it helps somebody with these e-conversions. I know they're kind of fun. Um, oh yeah, the ESC. So Hobby Wing, 80 amp, good for success. I think my amps are gonna be in the 60 mark, maybe 50, 60. Uh, most of the time these planes are pretty light, so I don't have to hammer on it the whole time. Anyways, that's it, enjoy.